today let's uh, discuss about the uh, stage settings stage setting uh, release in delay protection coordination whenever we are uh, doing the delay protection coordination sometimes for the better coordination purpose we use different stages uh, of a relay so let's discuss about the different uh, stages of uh, idmt delay to understand the better coordination let's start so here uh, if we go here uh, this is the uh, relay abb ref 542 plus relay i have selected here let's understand the different stages here as you can see here in the uh, oc level over current this is oc1 this is oc1 and this is oc2 so this relay has two uh, two stages so this is stage one under this stage one this is 51 this is itmt uh, 51 over current and the second one this is instantaneous this is instantaneous fine but we can use uh, we can use this instantaneous as a um, short time delay suppose uh, here uh, i have used uh, for the short time delay let's say let's say 500 millisecond that means 0 0.5 second this is in second but for 51 this is time dial this is not in second this is time dial setting 0 0.48 this is time dial okay so let's uh, coming back to this topic so this 51 if i say this is stage one and this is short time in 50 setting this is 50 setting but this is not actually instantaneous this is short time this is short time setting so if i call this uh, stage 2 if i call this as uh, stage 2 then if we go here this oc2 and if we enable here if we enable and here here there is no 51 in stage 2 only instantaneous only instantaneous function is available okay so before enabling this uh, uh, this oc2 level let's go to oc1 and let's create uh, let's create uh, let's go to the uh, tcc curve for better understanding <coughs> okay so here in this tcc curve here in this tcc curve as you can see here if we go this is oc1 51 is enabled 50 also enabled but this is not instantaneous basically this is short time delay 500 millisecond intentional delay i am giving so this curve will look like this so this is 51 and this is 50 this is 50 and this is 51 now okay now if i want to do the better coordination and if it is required uh, let's say this stage 3 this is required i want to i want to coordinate this part also I want to coordinate this part also basically this is applicable for uh, in the downstream if there is any motor let's say this is motor so this motor starting curve will be like this will be like this so in that case we can use three four stages for better coordination purpose okay for uh, for this case also we can do this for the sake of example for sake of clarity we'll do this we'll go here in the editor and go to this oc2 enable this instantaneous check this box and here you can see here you can see let's say this is 12 that means 3600 primary amps 
this review and this is the time delay what is the delay there is no intentional time delay this is the minimum time required for the relay for the instantaneous operation also so this time we have to give we cannot uh, make it zero because the range is uh, delay range is starting from this here you can see 0 0.015 to 30 that means the minimum setting we are giving that means there is no intentional time delay so we are enabling this uh, this stage 3 okay now the curve will look like this you can see you can see this is 51 of oc1 stage this is 50 of oc1 stage and this is 50 from oc2 stage this is from oc2 stage so the final curve will look like this so there are three stages this is stage one stage two stage three so this is coordinated like this so to coordinate for the better coordination with downstream or upstream network you can use different stages by the use of this settings see this is under OC1 this is 51 this is 50 but short time and under OC2 only this instantaneous this is instantaneous this is truly instantaneous that means there is no intentional time delay so this is the main uh, thing uh, for the different uh, stages for the relay protection coordination purpose so this was the very basic and um, brief discussion about the relay stage settings if you want to uh, know further in detail i can uh, i can uh, definitely come back with uh, real time example real time project uh, example with the help of uh, real time project sld i will draw that one uh, let's say for a for a motor for a motor like this so that uh, normal running current will be like this and this starting current will be like this so in that case also we can use suppose stage one stage two stage three like this we can use different stages for for the better coordination accurately so today up to this if you have uh, any doubt any sort of uh, confusion you can definitely uh, put your comment in the comment box i will come back as soon as possible